Hello. Welcome to Heal Dose. Here is a basic tutorial on the eat more, weigh less diet, including a brief overview, foods to include and avoid in the diet, as well as some positive and negative aspects. Dean Ornish is well known in the medical profession for using nutrition to reverse heart blockages, which was previously thought to be impossible without surgery or medicines. Eat more, weigh less, Dr. Dean Ornish's Life Choice Program for Losing Weight Safely, While Eating Abundantly was published in 1993. It soon rose to the top of the New York Times bestseller list. The Eat More, Weigh Less Diet is a high-fiber, low-fat eating plan was designed to help you lose weight and improve your health. Meat eaters, vegetarians, and vegans can all follow this diet, however less meat is recommended. Regular exercise and stress reduction are also important to Dr. Ornish. Aside from weight loss, this diet may help to prevent and perhaps treat certain types of heart disease. Dr. Ornish believes that weight loss can occur with the appropriate combination of food and activity, even if people eat more frequently and in bigger amounts. He proposes that fat make up less than 10% of total calories and divides the diet into things that should be consumed all of the time, some of the time, and never. Vegetables. Fruits. Whole grains. Egg whites. Beans. Non-fat dairy. Nuts and seeds and healthy oils are the ideal items to include in this diet. In this diet, you would avoid full-fat dairy. Sugar. Alcohol. Processed foods. Refined grains and trans fats. The benefits include the fact that this diet plan is a healthy diet rich in fruits and vegetables. It respects the individuality of each person. It has the potential to reverse cardiac disease and restore cholesterol balance, and it distinguishes between healthy and bad fat. Meanwhile, this diet is little bit restrictive. With this diet meat reduction may be challenging for some people and others may flourish on full fat dairy products. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you know or suspect that you have a health problem, you should consult a health professional.